never played this game before, so this is the first playthrough. Um, when I was looking at the description for the game, um, it did show that there were mentions of self-harm and suicide, so please be mindful of that. Um, if you are going to get triggered, um, please do not watch the stream. Um, <clears throat> so, uh, yeah, let's go ahead and get right into this. Let me, um, close this out right quick. I want to make sure... I want to make sure, uh, that I'm going to have the, uh, whatchamacallit? Alright, let's go ahead and get into this. Uh, you have missed messages. Start. Okay, there we go. Trigger warning. There are mentions of suicide and self harm in this game. Perfect for staying inside and finishing my work. Oh, I get to look around. Oh, she's. Oh, look, she's a trans. Um, and we hold on. This music is kind of loud in my ear. There we go. She has the uh, trans and the uh, pride flag. I love that. Um, let me do something right quick. Let me mute that. Okay. All right. So, um, I guess we look around the room. Flags. Not saying I'm gay, but also kind of one. Also, kind of what I'm saying. I love that. Uh, books. What books we got? Love my books. There's How to Raise a Plan, Piracy for Dummies, and my favorite memes to movements. Um, tea. Tea is perfect on a day like this. Beautiful, quiet, calm. Um, my roommate's door. She used to keep it open now, it's usually closed. Hmm. Mirror. Eclate. Is that a Madoka Magica poster? <laughs> it's like the first thing I noticed. A classic look. I'm adulting successfully. I feel that. Um, what else we got? Plants? I bought them with my roommate, May, to add life to our rooms. Now we have green friends that welcome us home. Got more, more plants over here. Got some cacti. Uh, we got some headphones. Laptop. I want to see what else I can explore first before I click on the laptop. Outdoor. The door to outside world. Go back. Yeah, I'd rather stay inside. Okay. What we got on the laptop? Ugh, I need to work. But I'm so bored, I can't focus. Uh, she has uh, Photoshop. Goth the GS iPhone wants to send you a note. What's this? Should I accept it? Accept it. <laughs> That's so cute. He has a little step back and some glasses. Send meme back. Thank you for Doug. Send it. Oh. Can I? Send you a note. You're welcome. So, Pastel Princess MacBook Pro, what are you up to? Working but can't focus. Can I close this up? <coughs> Excuse me. Oh my god. Oh no, I feel that. I hope I'm not distracting you. I also can't focus. I'm procrastinating with makeup right now. <laughs> Tell me I'm beautiful, mother. <laughs> oh, they're so cute. I want you wrapped in my arms like a burrito. Be my burrito. Go out with me. Sure. This escalated quickly. Yes, I'll see you. This is so cute. Okay. So work stuff. A X plus B Y plus C Z equals D. What even is a four dimensional shape? Okay, so how do I? Okay, so she's listening to Spotify. She's talking to Goth GF. <clears throat> it's currently 8:15 p.m. What time? Later tonight outside my room. Okay, so let's go back. Later that night, I went out to meet Goth GF. Before I left my room, I <clears throat> opened her door. Oh, she's pretty. Oh, 
It's my birthday. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Oh, she started singing. Oh no, is this when it's gonna happen? Oh no, please, I'm already about to start crying. <laughs> she told me her name, Amy. We walked to the roof, laid out a blanket, and watched the stars. Arts. Let's talk about arts. Hell yeah, I am. God, can you imagine being so powerful you can transform into different people? Cause I can. God is a woman. Have you thought about being a makeup artist? You think that I'm that talented? You're sweet. God, that'd be amazing. The competition is fierce though. I'll just stick with it as a hobby. That's fair. If you ever need someone to practice, looks on, I volunteer as tribute. You're a beautiful canvas. I'll definitely take you up on that. Let's talk about the sky. The sky is gorgeous tonight, I know, right? I'm forever that girl that gets really excited when the sky is in pretty colors. What do you think of when you look at the sky? Nothing, for once, only a feeling. Damn. Nothing? You know when your mind is constantly noisy? I look at the sky and I realize it's so much bigger than me. My problems mean nothing compared to it and my mind quiets. It's so poetic. <clears throat> Let the time pass. It's getting late, we should head back. Oh, you're cute. Goodbye kiss. No, I'm not going to kiss you right now. No, 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 no. Oh my god, no, May, please no. May, no, 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 no. No, no, no. Oh my god. She killed herself. Oh my god, she killed herself. Do I go back? How do I? Bro, like the suicide was right off the bat. My disembodied self watched me move and talk like an actor in the surreal circus I found myself in. I overheard strangers and friends talk on like talk. Did you hear what happened? No. What? Someone committed suicide. That's so sad. Who? Here? The second floor. You probably don't know her, man. Eh? No, but that sucks. Most pitied the way she went, but didn't miss her. But I remembered her smile, her laugh, the way she'd be kind in small news. I couldn't forget her. When new people came into my life, I searched for her and I'm like, she told me. I hope she was still here. It was only during the funeral that the reality sunk in. At the funeral, I heard her sing a now sad and song. Her singing when everyone else forgot and her not being the only one to remember. As I listened to her, my disembodied self crashed down to reality. The pain hit, this time without the anesthesia of shock. This was real. She was dead, and we were putting her in the ground. Oh my god, that's it? Are you kidding me? I have to start over. Oh my god. Okay, let's try this again. So, my first mistake. <laughs> a heavy blizzard stretched on for miles. In the distance, I saw a figure. Me. Oh, me? It's not safe here. May, is that you? Come back. She just smiled, looking content amidst the dangerous hail, as if she was going somewhere better, as if she hadn't heard my voice, lost in the blizzard. <laughs> don't go. Please, don't go alone. She disappeared into the snow. I'd missed my chance. <laughs> it was a nightmare. I wake up in a cold sweat, fearful, but not sure why. What was that about? Never mind that, I should start working. She used to keep it open now, it's usually closed. I remember that dream I had. Bro, this is so fucking sad. Let's go in the mirror, I look the same. Pros of wearing black, hot as hell. Cons of wearing black, it's hot as hell. I feel that. Ugh, I need to work, but I dream I can't focus. 
What's this? Should I accept it or decline in that for now? Let's work. I make a valiant attempt at work and after some minutes I get tired and want to take a break. Work. I spend 30 minutes trying to understand but ultimately end up and confused. Why am I a fool hooligan and oh with the PhD in buffoonery? It's weird to hear voices. Seems like they're coming from my roommate's door. Getting closer, I hear voices. Listen. Although my Chinese is bad, I can still detect an angry Chinese voice. I'm not even gonna try to like say that. Too lazy, why don't you? Her mother's fast lecture in Chinese sometimes paused. Lecture in Chinese sometimes paused for me. A soft murmur of affirmation then continued. I felt like I was listening to something I shouldn't have. So I distanced myself from the door. What do I do from here? Let's go let's go to the bathroom. I do what I gotta do, then go back. The noise from my roommates has quiet down. I'm confused. I'm confused. Did we just start over? Um, shit, what should I say? Wait, shit, hold on. Did the- well, I'm confused. Did this just start over? It did. It did start over. She went back in her room to get something. When she came back, we laid on my bed, looking out at the setting sun. Talk about her stuffy. So what are you holding? Oh, my pug? <laughs> I call him Potato. Oh, he looks so well loved. Yeah, he is. My dad gave me him. That's so sweet. Yo, yeah, well, yeah, it's your birthday, right? I forgot. He remembered? Of course I did. Happy birthday She's singing happy birthday again. She sang me happy birthday. Oh, thank you for remembering. As the years flew by, my birthday became like any other day. No one else had remembered it either, but she had. So how have you been? Fine, just tired. Big mood, how so? I don't know, like a bone deep tiredness day after day? You think you're depressed? Um, maybe? I took antidepressants a long time ago, but I felt like they didn't work. Maybe it's the type of antidepressant? Maybe you need to try a different one? Don't take my advice, actually, I know nothing. <laughs> me neither. Not just about this, but in general. I feel you. Has it gotten better, the tiredness? Not really. By now, I kinda just want to die. Are you suicidal? Um. Oh my god, sorry, that was that too blunt. Feel free not to answer. No, you're good. Yeah, I think about it sometimes. I feel like we all do, though. I imagine how it'll go down, how it'll look, snow, the afternoon. Whether anyone would care that I was gone, not just how about how it went. You know what, I don't- I don't know if I can play this. Um, I didn't- I think I- I thought I could handle it, but uh... I, th I think I can handle it. I'm pretty sure I can. How, how would it go down? Do you really want me to talk about it? I'd probably cry. I know, you're awkward around crying people. Hey, me too, don't worry. Yeah, it sucks. Gun policy makes it hard to get a gun around here. If I owned a gun, I'd probably be dead a long time ago. I'm scared of other methods. I might survive, and if I do, the pity people would feel. The brain damage that I'd have is scary. Maybe it's selfish, but I'm glad you're scared. I don't want you to go. You mean a lot to me. Thanks. I just realized she's laying on my arm. Should I talk about my dream? Let's talk about the dream. I need to hear this. You were in a snowstorm? And I called for you, but you didn't hear me, and I lost you. What does it mean? 
I have no idea, but it stuck with me. I hope you're okay. I hope you're okay too, May. It's just a dream. Here, if you're still scared by bedtime, I'll tell you a bedtime story, okay? Oh yeah, bedtime stories. What do you dream about? Disturbance, someone always dies. Like my most recent one that featured you, actually. In a good way or a bad way? Good. Go on. There was a massive epidemic. It was gonna wipe out the world. I got infected, I was gonna die. Then you discovered the cure and I was saved. Wow, that's scary. I always knew I was gonna save the world. Yeah, dream you really saved me. Can we talk about her parents? Oh yeah, what were those noises about? Hmm? Earlier in your room. Ah, my mom called. Sorry, did I bother you? No, she sounded really angry though. Uh, yeah. She and I... Is everything okay with you two? I don't know, every time my mom calls I feel sick, angry. You want to talk about it? Talk about what? What she makes- why she makes you feel that way? You sound like a therapist. How are you feeling and why are you feeling that way? I just want to help you. Yeah, I know. I was always the golden child when I was young. I was good at everything, so my parents never pushed me to work hard at anything. As I grew up, I started lagging behind because I didn't put in effort. The only thing I would put effort into was writing. They yelled at me when they caught me writing. Writers weren't engineers or doctors. Writing would never make money. Now, my life is slowly falling apart and instead of listening to me and helping me, my parents are yelling at me for wasting time playing games. Wow, thank you for telling me this. That's fucked. Thanks for listening. I want to know more about your writing. What did you write about? I love the way they cuddle with each other when she's talking about something passionate. Before your parents made you stop. Oh my god, it's embarrassing. You can tell me. Okay, you won't laugh? I promise. Harry Potter fan fiction. You said you wouldn't laugh. Sorry. I'm just surprised. Don't be ashamed. That's awesome. I love Harry Potter. If you say so. I do say so. Why do, Why not write more than of that? Everyone likes writing though. Anything creative, art, music, writing it doesn't count. That's not true. There's plenty of successful writers out there. But I'm not one of them. I'd never be able to make a living out of it. And my parents would get so angry. Would you rather live the way you're currently living or live poor but happy? Besides, who said you're not good enough to make it profitable? I don't know. What are you thinking? Uh, I think I could be a good writer if I worked hard enough, but it's so much easier to give up and just not work. You could give up. I see struggle as a hill I need to climb to get the reward at the other end. You could give up, or you could get the reward on the other side. Motivational speaker much? Haha, <laughs> nah. I've just had a lot of hills that I just wanted to give up on. Have you ever given up? Nope. Well, sometimes. If it's something I couldn't care less about, like my haha. <laughs> But if I care about it, then I pull through and I never regret it. Imagine, I'm going to work harder and getting my life back together. I'm just, I miss. I thought that said imagine for a second. It's tough. No. Yeah, it's hard to work on something you don't like. Give me a math problem and I'll snore. Give me a computer science problem and I'll look at it for hours. Thanks, I really mean it. I think my parents got in my head. I needed your push. Anytime. Let the time pass. We talked more about everything and nothing. Some TV shows and memes are our worst fears and things desired. Before we knew it, evening dawned. I gotta go. I have work. Yeah, good luck. I'm always down to hang again. Thank you for listening to me. It really means a lot. I wanted them to cure us. <laughs> My maze door is open. I wonder where she is. Can we not talk to her? Let's go to the laptop. Got this. What does this say? What's this? Should I accept it? Yeah, accept it. I wanna see what it is. Message me back, partner. Are you good, Finn? What the fuck is a partial derrid? Let's accept this. So cute. Send a note back. Yawn. Wow, time flies by fast. Oh, it's been an hour. Oh, let me go use the bathroom. Bathroom. Oh my god, you gotta be kidding me. 
She didn't seem to hear or see me. Are you fucking kidding me? May. Hey, are you okay? Fine, I'm sorry. Why are you apologizing? I... Are you... Oh my god. After a pause, she spoke. Thank you. I guess I'm not okay. I just say I'm okay because it's a gut reaction. I don't really feel okay, but I don't want to bother anyone. Especially you. You're so kind. I made soothing motions on her back. Why are you sad? I don't know. I... I don't really want to talk right now. That's okay, I'm here for you. I'm not a professional or anything, but when you need to talk, I always listen. Is there anything I can do? Hug. Just hug. It's been months since that day, May, and I have gotten closer. I didn't consider her a best friend. Dark moments we held each other's hands. Although I supported her, I didn't want to feel responsible for her. Didn't want her to be dependent on me. So we drove to every therapist in town until we found one she liked. One night, May hugged me by surprise. May? Thank you. Me? For what? I, uh, don't know what to say. I don't know how to say this without seeming emotionally constipated. Thanks for caring about me. For listening to me. I couldn't tell you before because I was sad, but I appreciate you, really. Aw, uh, anytime. Thank you, too. For being my friend. Here. Oh my god, no you. No you. Uno reverse. <laughs> Later that night, she gave me a note, both haunting and touching. It read... I was buried in the blizzard. The snow piled up powerful and unpredictable never ended. I weakly cried for help and no one came, my voice lost in the snow, but you saw my messages. You grabbed the shovel, I helped, and I could have finally opened my door. That's it! I saved her! Ah! I did it! I- Okay, so I saved her, and... I'm not gonna lie, I started crying. Like... This, I'm gonna get sappy for a moment, we're gonna get real personal. This specific game, some of the things she was saying, especially when she was talking about her, uh, how she could imagine it, I felt that. You know, when I was younger, it, I, I used to feel like that, but after having somebody there for you, after having somebody there for you, it, the way uh, our character was there for me, it helps. It helps a lot. But that was all we do is hurt each other here, <laughs> Summer Madness. But um, that was a good game. Um, it really makes you think, um, you know what choices you have to make or what is more important what it what should you prioritize over something else you know um i really like that i know i went through it pretty fast but i didn't expect it to be that short they said it was like a 15 30 minute playthrough um but i think that's generally if you make the wrong choices the way i had to start over again then you have that dream um but i got confused because i thought the dream like it was supposed to start like another like continuation and that's why I started speeding through it. But I didn't know if things were supposed to be different the second time around. Um, but yeah, so I genuinely enjoyed that game. Um, yeah, I just... It was good. It was it was really good. I liked it. And I'm really glad the creators made this. Who, who did this? Angela. Hey. She has a Tumblr and Twitter. Hmm. Alright, well, check her out. You know, uh... This was a good game. I'm, I'm gonna definitely shout her out. Um, it was good. It was good. Uh, but I guess that's enough missed messages for now. Um, I don't know, man. That was that was sad. Like, there's just so much I can talk about with these games. So much. I don't. I don't know, man. It was. It was good. It was a good game. Um, let me see something. I don't know if...
I kind of want to go through it again with different um with different choices this time. I don't. I do. I kind of want to go through it again with different choices. Oh, what is can I do? Ultra high. I can just do medium, very low, and high. Ultra high. This is such a beautiful game. Like I do want to talk about that. It is such a beautiful game honestly and then like i never like after playing it then you start noticing all the little things about it like i thought this was just some random chick sitting next to her i just thought this was just like red paint and i didn't notice the scissors is with you know the blood on this is blood right here this is all blood that's may may is leaning on her shoulder for support um but yeah i, I genuinely enjoyed that game and uh, hopefully uh, I'm gonna try to find more games like this to play. Let me, let me see. I could probably get one right quick. I'm just gonna keep that there. Let me pull this up. Store. I might have to... Let's see. Uh, okay. Um... Shh, 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 shh. I need more games like I love I love games like this. I I love games like this. Oh wait, hold on. There's more choices. I just okay. We're gonna play this again. I just saw the achievements. Ah, a beautiful day. Perfect for staying inside and finishing my work. I think I know what I have to do. Okay, so I'm gonna go through this like because we know all this. Okay, I'm gonna go through it again. I need to work, but I'm so bored I can't focus. So we're gonna decline that. No, decline it. Work. Hmm, planes. Y equals MX plus B. After some time I start to lose focus. No, decline. Again. Okay, so that's what May's parents come on. No, stop sending me stuff, you dumb slut. Oh, that was rude of me. Why am I a full hooligan and oaf with a PhD of buffoonery? The door of my roommate, May. I wonder if I should check up on her. Hello? Oh, it's May. Hey there, sweet cheeks. Yes? Uh, shit, what should I say? Let's hang out. And do what? I don't know, talk, but I have work to do. Take a break. You always have work to do. You should take a break. Besides, we haven't hung out. I miss you. I could use a break, to be honest. And I miss you too. Okay, so we're gonna hang out. Um, okay, so let's talk about... Let's talk about life. A lot. Uh, sorry, I haven't stayed updated. Stay updated like I'm your favorite TV show. Don't worry about it. I just feel like it'll make enough time for you. That's okay. You're not obligated to. Oh well, yeah, it's your birthday, right? <laughs> I forgot. You remember? Of course happy I did. Happy birthday to you. She sang me happy birthday. Happy birthday to you. Uh, how are you? We're just gonna skip through this because this is gonna be the same as last time. Let the time pass. Okay, so what we're gonna- this is terrible what I'm gonna do, but when- if it shows that she's in the bathroom again, I'm gonna end up leaving. Um, I'm gonna see if there's more options later on. I really hope she doesn't kill herself. Okay, okay, so the rooms- okay, so we're gonna wonder where she is. Let's work. Um, let's accept that. You good fam? Uh, what's this? Should I accept it? Let's work. Okay, now let's go to the bathroom.
bathroom. Okay, so May's in here then. I opened the door to my roommate May. She didn't see or hear me. Hey, are you okay? I'm fine, I'm sorry. Why are you apologizing? I'll go. I'm sorry, you clearly need some privacy. I'll go. May moved out. I haven't heard from her since. Before she left, she wrote me a note. I was buried in the blizzard. The snow pelted. I weakly cried for help, but no one came. Let's forget about it for now. Survivor. Surviving one night at a time. Oh shoot, okay, so there's one more I have to do then. Okay, so we're gonna go through the bathroom scene again. And, uh... Okay, we're gonna do the bathroom scene again. Let's, uh... Let's go to the laptop. Uh, let's... I need to work. I'm so bored, I can't focus. Let's work. Bill, where's Bill now when I need to answer important questions? Okay, so hear the voices. Let's go to major room. I respect your privacy. Okay, so I guess I'll go back to work. Work. Alright, now let's go check on May. Okay, do I just accept this then? <sighs> Send note back. Okay, now I can go to May. <clears throat> she is so pretty. I can't get over that. <clears throat> um, are you okay? Just want to make sure you're okay. I heard noises from room early. I'm fine. Or well, I'm kind of sad, but don't worry about me. Okay, so if I... Alright, let's see. Okay. Let's go from here. Let's see if I... Okay, so I'm gonna hang out with that girl again after uh, telling May I'm not gonna hang out with her see what we're gonna get. You are the cutest. The art for this game is so gorgeous. Hey, girl, you might not be in, but I take those layers off. Yeah, I'll go out with you. Oh, you know exactly what I mean, honey. Hear the definition of useless lesbian maybe inside my room tonight. It says after 9 and it's 10.33. Happy birthday to I didn't mean to hit my mic. Man, this hurts me doing this, like... Oh my god, this hurts me. It's hurting me physically. I met up with God GF. She told me her name, Amy. We walked to the roof. Uh, let the time pass. I don't want to talk about anything. Yeah, we can kiss. Sure, we can kiss each other. You're the cutest. No, you. Haha, <laughs> I'll see you later. See you. You're a great friend. It's not hurts me so much. It was within the span of literally, like, tw 20. It was in the span of. No. I can't do my math. I'm not even gonna try to do my math. Uh, 
Oh, I I can't open the door. Okay, I'm. It's probably gonna show. It's probably not gonna show. Oh, oh my God, she hung herself. She fucking hung herself. There's no blood, but I felt blood on my hands. I felt myself looking down on the scene myself. Or at least that eventually came a disembodied feeling and heard myself scream endlessly. She fucking hung herself. Oh my god. Did you hear what happened? No, what? Some suicide. Second floor, you probably don't know her, but that sucks. I heard her singing out sad and low. I know it wasn't my fault, but I'm feeling just back. I wonder if I'll ever be able to forgive myself. Oh, I got all the endings though. That's terrible, but I got all the endings. I oh my god, I genuinely enjoy this game. Like your choices do make a big difference. Um, and uh. <laughs> Yeah, your choices make a big difference. Um, what was I gonna do? Oh. Well, that's it. That's that's the game right there. I was supposed to see if I could find other games like this, but, uh... Let's see. Um... It's hot in my room. <sighs> what was I gonna? Let me let me look. I'm gonna look for for something. <laughs> Let's take a forever load. Okay. Thank <laughs> you. 